Hi, I see a lot of questions about how to control Unreal Engine with OEC, and also can't find any good tutorials about that. So I decided to show the easiest way to create OEC server and how to control Unreal Engine with touch design. You will learn how to control light, change actor's size and position, and how to control level streaming with OEC. Let's start. Activate OEC plugin and restart Unreal Engine. Create blueprint class and call it OEC server. You can find OEC presets on Unreal Engine website. Let's copy binding and even to all messages and paste it to blueprint OEC server. Change IP address to 127001 and port to 7000. Then replace integer with float. This blueprint show on screen all incoming messages. Let's see how that work. Start touch designer, create a constant and set name. For example, level 1 test. Add OEC out and change port to 7000. Press play and editor. We see received messages and that means that everything is configured correctly. But after few seconds OEC server stops and we can't see any messages. As I found it's very common problem. To fix this we need to create loop that restart OEC server if no message received. So we've done with OEC server. Let's create OEC message handler. Open OEC server blueprint. Add sequence, then copy blueprint binding and even to address patterns and paste it to graph. Delete all unnecessary nodes and add get OEC message float at index. Set variable for OEC server. and connect it to handler. This handler will process incoming OEC messages and transmit the received data. We can collapse graph so it doesn't take up so much space in the editor. Connect float value and execution to output. And add string to input and call it OEC message. Go back to event graph. So we've done with OEC handler. Now let's learn how to control light with OEC. Create a point light. Now we need to create variable for point light. In variable type select actor and then object reference. Set variable to public. In OEC server click pick actor from scene and select point light. In this example we will control light intensity. Get OEC light variable and select cast to point light. With cast we will be accessing and modifying the point light parameters. Turn off context sensitivity and select set intensity. Connect target and float value. Now we need to get OEC command to control intensity. For example, level 1, light 1, int. Copy string and open touch designer. Paste OEC command and constant name. Add math and set range 0 to 10 to see better result. Press play and edit and change constant value. Now let's add color control to point light. Copy graph and connect to sequence. Select set light color. And from new light color select make linear color. Now we need to set value for each color in RGB. To do that copy graph two times more. And connect float value for each color. Connect graph execution.
Now set OEC command for each color. For example, level 1 light 1 R, level 1 light 1 G, level 1 light 1 B. Open touch designer and end to constant command for each color. Also add merge and connect intensity and color constants. We did this because colors are in range from 0 to 1, but intensity is from range 0 to 10. Press play in editor and change constant value for color. Let's now try to change position and size of actor, for example a cube. Duplicate OEC control and connect it to sequence. As with point light, create a variable and select cube. Add the select actor scale 3D and connect variable for cube. From new scale, select make vector. Example, I will make uniform scale for cube, so I connect one flow to all axes. Now set OEC command for cube scale, for example, level 1 cube 1 size. Open touch designer and add to constant command for cube scale. Press play in editor and change cube scale. Now let's try to change the position of cube. Duplicate OC control and connect it to sequence. Add the set actor location and connect cube variable to it. From new location select make vector. In this example I will move cube in one direction, so I connect flow to the Z axis. Now set OC command for cube position, for example level 1, cube 1, Z. Open touch designer and then the constant command for cube position. Add math and set range from 0 to 100. Also we need to set cube mobility to movable. Press play and editor and change cube position. And now let's see how to control level streaming with OEC. Open level window and create new. Set name to second level. Delete all unnecessary actors from level. And for example create sphere on second level. Duplicate OEC control and connect it to sequence. In this example we will check if the value is 0, then the second level will turn off. If value is 1, then second level will turn on. Add a quill float, connect float value and set 1 to second value. Add branch and set true to load stream level and unload to false. Enter second level name and set make visible after load. Now set OC command for level streaming, for example level change. Open touch designer and add to constant command for level streaming. Press play and editor and switch levels. Sphere appears when level starts to stream. I hope you found this tutorial useful, so don't forget to like this video and subscribe to channel. If you know more simple way to control Unreal Engine with AC, then write about it in comments. Thank you for watching this video.